Judge Ahmed Rifat announced on Monday that the court will reconvene on September the 5th to begin hearing evidence involving the case of Hosni Mubarak. The trial of the former Egyptian leader will be combined with that of ex-Interior Minister Habib El Adli and six former police commanders. All the defendants face charges of authorizing the use of live ammunition to quell protests in January and February, which put an end to Mubarak's three-decade rule. More than 800 people died and over 6,000 were injured during the 18-day protests that ended on February the 11th. The judge said he will no longer allow live broadcasts of the trials from the next court session. Earlier, Mubarak was flown in by helicopter to a temporary court at a police academy in the suburbs of Cairo. He appeared in the dock on a stretcher alongside his two sons, Gamal and Allah, who are also accused of grab charges. The session went into recess after about 20 minutes. Mubarak had been staying in a military hotel in the capital city since his first court appearance on August the 3rd. The 83-year-old former leader and other co-defendants all pleaded not guilty to the charges against them during the opening court session. Mubarak's lawyer has challenged the judge to call 1,600 witnesses, including top military officers.